Hello everyone, a quick video about how to merge connection into site. Please note that this process requires the version 6.04 of Entropass. Merging connection into site that will allow us to merge existing connection into site. It is very important to make a backup. Actually, this is the normal process. Um, migration, upgrade, uh, programming changes. So it is required to make a backup before we make any of those. So please do so. Make a backup of the existing system. Now, remember, in Kentech, we have... Um, we can have 100 schedules per side. We can have about 249 um, access level by site and, and so on. So when we're going to do the merge, it is important to verify the component that we have. Uh, the system itself will prompt us with uh, a message if there is any excess and the system will be deleting any component. But uh, it is important for us, um, good practices to verify the component before we make the move. Okay, um, the merging will automatically merge and remove any duplicated holidays. All right, so I'm going to, um, right after I finish with the step, the practice part in the application so i will get back to those screens so you can see better yourself now the step make backup of the system of the current system verify the component verify the site connection take a look at the uh, schedule that we have access level if we do not have a site um, for example, we could be having all our connection created directly under the gateway. Um, so we can create site if necessary. Then we'll go with the step of merging connection to the site. After we're done with that, we're going to verify if everything is okay, verify the component, and then we make a new backup. That's it with the step. Now let's move on with practice in the software itself. All right, we make it back up as we said. So I'm going to option backup scheduler. Check mark it now. So I'm making a data backup. I'm going to wait for the confirmation that my backup is ready. Then I'm going to the step, which verify component, schedule, stuff like that as we stated in the previous screen okay so i have backup data backup completed so let's take a look what we have in here as we can see i don't have any site created all the connection is directly under the gateway right now i have three connection i have a one bogota training room a demo and i have the montreal training location so I have three connection. Of course, I can take a look at access level. Okay, I have Bogota training, training room, demo, Montreal training. Of in, if necessary, I can go by connection. I have connection. I have the default one, and I have the one I created. So I verify pretty much at the schedule. I just have three schedules created. So, so far, nothing to worry about. I can proceed. Now, as we can see in my screen, I don't have any site. So, if I'm making that change, it's because I want to group maybe connection to site. So, I have to create the site. If I had site, existing site, I could merge the connection to the site, but now I don't have any site, so let's create. Uh, for that, I'm going to create two sites. One will be 
Montreal location and the next one will be Bogota location okay so I have the site now if I go operation site and connection I have the gateway where I have all my connection right now and I have the two side that I created then of course the empty they don't have any connection right now so I'm going to start with the Bogota one. So I go devices, site, I select Bogota. And then I have in the version 604, you have the tab there, which is what we need to do the merging, merge existing connection. So when I click there, I can see the gateway and I can see the site. Now I am in the, I can see the connection, I'm sorry. Now I have, remember I am at the Bogota and I want to move the Bogota connection to the Bogota side that I created. And I also want to use the demo connection. So I'm gonna have one side with two connection and uh, the other side will be with one. So now all I have to do is click on save and I have some question asking me if I want them to merge identical schedule, meaning if I have Two schedules are the same, they will make them one. For example, I have right now Monday to Friday with the same day time selected, so that will become one schedule because they are the same. And I have another check mark, I can leave it there or remove it. And what it's saying, add the site name as a prefix to all physical components. All right, so I got OK. And right now it give me a result of the merging telling me everything is completed and right now in the bogota location i have the two connection i'm gonna repeat that same step for my other side i go to devices i select the site now i'm gonna do the montreal one and i go to merge I check here, I just have one connection left. These, I have, right now, remember, I had three connections. I moved two into a side already, so I have one left. This one, I choose to move it to the Montreal side. Same. I have a report, result of the merging. That's it. Now, if I go operation, side, and connection, I go on the gateway, I have nothing. I go on the Bogota, I have two connections. I go on the Montreal, I have one. So I verify, make sure, and remember, make a new backup. I have a backup before I started the changes and I have a backup after. In case we need to roll back any changes, so I can just reload the backup. Okay, and as I said before, after I finish with those practice step i'm going back to the screen for you so you can take a look thank you for watching i hope this will help you um get your connection inside in a better shape remember this can be done if the connection was created uh without any side assignment if the connection was already in the side, you cannot move it. Okay. Thank you. Me again, one more note. Um, now, once you make those changes, I'm sure you don't want to forget any side assignment anymore. So there is a quick fix on that. 
you go to your intro pass, you go to options, system parameter, then you go workstation, and here you can change the way the system behave when you create a connection. Here I can say assign new connection into a site, I can make it mandatory, or I can ask the system to ask if I want to get it in a site or not. Or I can do it manually. If you want to avoid forgetting, you put it mandatory like that. Whenever you create a site, for example, here I go devices, connection, I'm sorry, whenever you create a connection, I got a demo connection. When I hit save, it will ask you to select the site you want to save that or to create a new one like that. You will not have the situation anymore. All your connection will be at the correct place. Okay, thank you very much.